That's right, Mark. Each one of these teams are 4-0 and looking to prove that they are the top team in the Beach District. It is Ocean Lakes hosting, and the school goes all out tonight. They hook up fans with these cool yellow shirts, and the Dolphins students, they're certainly excited for the matchup. I catch up with a few of them who are all about showing their school spirit tonight. Take a listen. Isn't it kind of exciting to be like the school spirit? Everyone kind of drawing on me, as you can tell by the uh, little eyeliner. I think it's really fun showing your school spirit with all of your friends. So both teams are pretty good, so it's going to be a really good game. Lately, we've been playing some like lower teams, so I think it'll be really good to see how they play against a higher team. And it is the away team that strikes first. Quarterback Xavier Davis hands it off to Tayon Holloway for a seven-yard run. Stallions, they get on the board, leading 6-0 in the first quarter. Ocean Lakes, they answer back on the falling possession, but it takes them a while. They eat up eight minutes on this drive, which culminates in that rushing TD by DJ James. We're all tied up at six. That tie, it does not last long, though, because on the kick return, Holloway will dodge, duck, dip, dive, and dodge defenders all over the place. He takes it 85 yards for the score. And the Stallions, they have a 13-6 lead. Now, Ocean Lakes does make this close. They pull within one point before halftime. But the Stallions' defense goes on to shut out the Dolphins in the second half, while the offense adds two more TDs to win this one 27-12. In Green Run, they are now the only undefeated team in the Beach District. So how does it feel, Stallions? It feels great. Like I said, we still got a long road ahead of us. It feels great. We, don't, we were going in the right direction, so we just got to keep on, keep on doing what we're doing and finish. Uh, it feels good. I feel that like we earned it. We worked hard every day in practice. So I like our results so far. Only chance is to keep going and um, finish the season undefeated. Going undefeated would also mean winning their first district title since way back in 1995.